Hello, bo hello, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're from. From the United States, from England to Jamaica. Big up to 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 Canada. This is your boy T. Giving you this week's episode of Haves and the Haves Not, season six, episode sixteen, I believe, or fifteen. I'm not sure. Anyhow, anywho. If you're not subscribed to my channel, I don't know what you're waiting for. I know you being I know people watch my reviews, stalking me, stalking my channel, making me. But if you don't if you want those people, don't be those people. You might as well subscribe to my channel. You know you will you know I'm gonna give you the truth. You know I'm gonna give you keep it real. Hit that subscribe button, hit that bell to right while you're right there. You might as well do that. I don't take you two seconds to uh see more of my videos. Comment on my videos. Like my videos if you don't like you like it, it's cool if you don't just, just say that that's what I want to see that you there and of course share your share my videos in all social media platforms anyhow anywho enough of that got my little got my little haircut right there got today looking so fresh and so clean outcast but anyway who cares about all that let's talk about has and the have not this actually was it was okay. It was actually a good episode. You know, those those dragon scenes, but you know that's from Tyler Perry, and, and you, that's what you're gonna get from Tyler Perry. But the episode was good. It was saying no honor in the game. So let's get into it, shall we? Last in the final scene of last week's episode, uh, Jeffrey and uh, and uh, Justin was uh, getting it on. Pipes were flowing in and out. That we, and and man, and Justin was doing backflips. He wanted that some of that chocolate goodness. And man, did he get some of that chocolate goodness? You you're telling me, boy. And I was like, I was like, I was like, oh my goodness, they're getting this. This was slobbering all type of goodness. And as we were going in, 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 we could see Bronca's face. When you see Veronica's face, her face is looking like she was cracked. Had a look at psh, her face on the ground, picked up the pieces, put some ham, some cheese, some, some salt and pepper. I scrambled it up because she was just going. That should be my, that should be my thumbnail right there. <laughs> that should be, that should be my thumbnail. Because that's the look she had when she seen her own son. Was getting it. He's like, Jeffrey, 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 why, why are you doing this? I'm trying. To... And Jeffrey saw it at first. He was, he was kind of like, huh, what? But he said, you know what? You want you want to see it, Mama? I'm gonna show you what I do. And just as a, and you know, just to hear it egging it on, so he was like, let's go and do it. And and and, and, and like, stop it, stop it, stop it. <laughs> He's making you do this. He's making you do this, Jeffrey. He's making you just do this. And and and, and I'm like, Frog, your son is gay. Do you not see the tapes? Do, do you not see the tape that you see that your son is? Ain't nobody about holding that man's head. That man likes sausage meat. He likes sausage meat when he was born. He, when he saw the, the sausage meat over here, he was licking his lips, chopping it like he wanted to cut it up and put that thing in there. You know he was there. He didn't want no kitty cat. He don't want it. He don't want the down there. He want the other what other meat. You know what I'm saying? He don't do the cat. You understand? He don't do that. He ain't into women. And you trying to be one of those parents like just pray the gay away. Ain't no praying the gay away. Here's who he is. And you dicks. You need to love him. That's who he is. He may not agree with his lifestyle, but boy, that's your son. Like David did. Do like David did. He accepted his son, but you can't. Cause you want to control everything. You want to control everything to, to make it fit, be, be your image, what he should be, so he could be the son that that you want him to be. Get married, Melissa. You know dang old well that he don't like Melissa. He ain't about that life. Melissa knows it. Jeffrey knows it. Everybody knows it, but you. But you don't want to see that. You don't want to accept that. So anyway, 
I digress, I digress, I digress. I know I went too long about this whole conversation, y'all, but forgive me. <laughs> and she was like, please stop it. I was going to get you off. And I'm going to get you off. And, and get and all you got to do is say that Benny did it. And Jeff was like, so you want me to say that Benny did it? Because I'm not going to do that. And then, you know, Vodka went, oh, you're left talking about. So you screwing Benny too? I was like, Vodka, really? <laughs> so basically, so that's what's the whole situation. He was screwing. And, and, and Vodka just, it's a hot mess. She's a hot mess. And she couldn't take it no more. And basically, baby girl, she's like, she left, she left saying, I'm going to fix you. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to fix it. Vanka done lost her mind. She, she never had mind to lose because she was, baby, she in the deep end. She's somewhere down planet Earth. She's somewhere in Vanka world that she just, whew, right there. And then, you know, Benny, no, that's it, Benny. Jeff, Justin was like, I want to get the closet. And then Jeff is like, you know, Stop it, stop it, stop it, just, it's just a mistake, you, you know, you just need to, you know, just, you need to just chill, you need to relax, you need to let me go, and just like, I ain't, you ain't going nowhere, I gave my life for you, I, I, I lost my family because of you, kind of, you know, it was your fault, Justin, because you didn't tell your wife that you were gay, if you told your wife that you were gay, the Leo on you would be the situation you were in, but I digress, I digress, I digress, so Playboy is like, I'll kill you. I got this D. I got some of this goodness right here. And I can't let it go. And this is my crack pack pipe. And I need this, some of that goodness. You ain't gonna leave me. Boy, I need some of that good stuff. I was like, oh, that's it, Jeffrey. Woo! Whatever he did to Justin, that Justin is turned out for the flow out. He out there. Right down there. <laughs> Anyhow, anywho. And then we got to, uh, uh, just uh, what's it? Benny and uh, you know we got the Benny, you know, and Hannah. Well, yeah, I do Benny Hannah scene because this this is quick. I do Benny Hannah scene. This this is this is dumb quick. Yeah, basically, uh, Benny's you know, Hannah wants Benny to help Melissa look for a place, and Benny's not with it. He basically said, look. I ain't, I ain't her daddy, you know. I don't want kids by her. I want to just put the put the pipe in there, and that's it. And why should I have to help her? And Hannah was like, "No one help me when help you and 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 your sister. So I need you. I'm gonna pay for it, and you are gonna pay for it by being the man. You're not gonna just hit and quit, Benny. You're not gonna. Hit. She got feelings, you know. I was like, you know what? True hand, you right. You suddenly do the right thing. You know, like, you know, like, now, as he overhears, as Mr. overhears this, and this is, I don't really have to, you don't got to do all that. And he says, yeah, don't worry, you're not burning, you're going to do it. And as Benny starts to leave, the money pops out. His money drops out. Because that's the money from the loans. So Henry of course Henry is really seen this, so she really knows this. He's she really knows what he's talking about. You know, where you get this money from, this and that, and Benny know he won't have it couldn't answer quick enough. So basically, Melissa saved his dumb A by saying that's that's my money, you know. And I'm just going and Henry said, Oh really, you got enough this is your money to find a place. He's like, Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm gonna find a place, blah 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 and Hannah says go and put the bank. Put in, you know, take it to the bank. And Melissa, you, I need, you need to go hold me some of that money. But they say, hell no, I ain't hold Give me that money. And I'm like, Benny, he, she saved you A.O. You should give her a little piece of something. Because you thinking that you're going to take that money to, to Malone and that's going to work out? Because Mitch, didn't that Mitch tell you that you can't, that money, to take that money back to Malone, that ain't going to work? Because you took the money. They don't want the, they want the money back in interest, son. You, once you touch that money, it's by interest. You sign it with your blood, son. This ain't, this ain't, you know, we don't do this the normal way, Benny. But, but Benny, like Kevin Hart gonna say today, you gonna learn today, Benny. You gonna learn today. You gonna learn, look at me. You gonna learn today. Pay attention, boy. Pay attention, Benny. But anyhow, anywho. 
Uh, what else is new? Jeff, you know, um, Jim calls, calls, uh, uh, I forget his guy's name. It wasn't Oscar. He calls Oscar. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I was throwing blanks. I was like, Phew. he calls Oscar and, and basically tells Oscar, look, the money's not there in the bank. What's, what's good, son? And Oscar, what are you talking about? The money's right there in the bank. I see you got the count money right there. What are you talking about? This was going back and forth until Jim said, look, I'm going to give you the count number and see if that's the count number that you have. When Oscar saw that, he said, oh, blank, blank, blank. And he realized that Candace was playing them like a sucker. He said, you know what? He said, mm -hmm. And then we see Charles. Charles in, uh, in Landon. Charles says, we need to have, you know, need to help Candace make every her plans felt to be part of her side. And Landon says, okay, I'm going to do it. I got this. Cool beans. And Charles says, cool. If I'm going kind of fast in these reviews, y'all, because... That's how I am. This wasn't a whole lot of scenes, so I'm gonna go in and out real quick. You know, I, I'm just giving you my thoughts. I'm glad that Charles is back, but I gotta think about this. Is Charles the president or the candidate? Cause I don't think he's the president, right? Cause he ain't even the president, he's the candidate. I don't know much about politics and I'm kinda slow. I'ma keep it funky, I'ma keep it fish. I'm slow as the, I'm slow as, I'm slow as, as the school bus. But I don't think candidates have that kind of power that can stop your money. Because they ain't, they ain't the president. They're just a candidate. I mean, they get the money for donations. Shout out to Stanley for random reviews for saying that. And I had to think about it for a second. He, he ain't no candidate. So how you how you pulling all these power moves? Like, how he doing it? Because he, he ran for presidency, right? So did he win? Because he's still running for presidency, right? So... It don't even matter, y'all. It don't even matter, y'all. Just, it don't even matter. It don't even matter. Because, your child don't care. Your boy, you don't care. He don't care. I don't care. Anyway. Right. So, basically, uh, Jim and uh, Catherine, Jim says, you know, Catherine says to Jim, we need to stop bailing Ryan out. He killed two people. He needs to take the fall for his actions. And I'm like, yes. Finally, Catherine says the right thing. Yes, you need to stop bailing your son out. He's he's a crackhead. He's a, like like Jamaican girl would say. He's on he's a crackhead. You know, rich people problems. And yes, it's rich people problems because probably have the problems. But boy, probably people don't get that kind of opportunity to screw up. You know what I'm saying? We don't get school. We don't get opportunity to keep screwing up, man. He screwed up many times. I mean, he killed. He, he kills two people. He always on crack. He always on dumb stuff. Give him money to see he can smoke it up and buy stupid drugs and get himself high. And then he he almost killed you when when things. But when something goes wrong, he so goes, "Mommy, I need money. Mommy, give me some money because the bank man going to kill me. Mommy, mommy, give me some money. Mommy, mommy, give me some money because the bank man with the gun going to kill me. Mommy, please, mommy, give me." Right? And Catherine's, they always build his A out. Finally, Catherine's actually getting smart and says no. But Jim has to say, you know, no, this ain't the same thing, low life criminal. This is the this is the Malones. And Catherine's the Malones. So, like, Catherine doesn't know what the Malones are. Malones are thugs. They're like the mafia. We don't play this right here. You kill one of my boys, I'm killing you. You saw how mama, you see how. Mama Rose was when I were, were, were shot at, at, her, at her grandson. Didn't kill him, but shot him. You know what happened to War, right? Do you see War in any of these episodes? No. He, he's digging up. He's in heaven or heaven right now. The, like, seeing Jesus. Hallelujah. That's it. He ain't there. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> But I still feel like they need to. You need to punish Ryan. Maybe says says They should have been doing that when they, when he was a kid, but I digress. And speak of speak of and then 
you know, Kevin tries to talk to Wyatt, and Wyatt's ungrateful, basically saying, you know, you ain't giving nothing. You're the worst mother ever. I don't like you. Where's my money? You know? And he basically said, I know you have breast cancer. I have... And said, Kevin, how do you know? He says, Psh, I know. I know these things. And basically said, I hope you die. I hope you die. I hope you die. And if I ain't, I'll snitch on myself and I'll take you down any two. I hope. I was like, dang, why? Dang, why? You want great for mother blank. I mean, I can see you being that way with Jim because Jim is a piece of crap. So I understand you want to be that way with Jim. And that's cool being in the episodes. So you want to do that. But man, your mama carefully been going hard for you, protecting you, A. Always saving you, A. Always there with you. I got it best. And. What else? Oh, I missed this up. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm throwing blanks. Uh. Basically, Catherine said, not Catherine, Candy says, I'm gonna quit the game. I'm gonna quit the game, y'all. He got, she got, he, she got the crew. Rocky was there. All Jay was there. And Gina was there. And she tells the, tells the people, look, you both, your girl's gonna quit the game because I came out big. And she's like, what am I gonna do? I need you. I'm like, <laughs> she tells Gina, look, use Jim for all he got. He got money. Take Take the money from him. And all the was like, what am I going to do? I just came out. Who? And I don't like men. I'm like, mm-hmm. Yeah, you like some, some of that sauce in me. I like you don't want no sauce in me. She, Kathy said, no. Kenneth says, look, you see, you're, you're a good-looking guy. Get your, your young, get your old single woman who's lonely. Take advantage of that. So he, she got rid of them, too. Rocky was like, <clears throat> he came up big. He said, yeah, I came up big. So I should get a piece. Let me get, you know, cut me a piece. And Kevin says, Kevin says I'm not giving you nothing. Sorry. And Rocky said, I took the picture. If I didn't take the picture, you wouldn't get the money. What, that $20, $30? I'm like, damn. And basically says, you ain't scared, you ain't getting nothing. And I'm like, Candace, this is why you got you killed by Wall because you lied and played them. And this is why you don't This is what Candace, I can't stand with Candace. Like, you don't, you double costing them. You basically, like, you need to, like, you know, don't burn your bridges because you think you got the money. And I bet you in the next episode, you don't think you got the money, money ain't there. But she actually is smart because what she does in the next scene, she does <coughs> tell Benny, she gives the money to Benny. He just tells Benny to hold the money for a while. And Benny says, he kind of reluctantly duck. Doesn't saying that. Hope it doesn't work. Hope it works because this is the amount of ass eighty-five thousand in the bank. This has to work. And Benny be like a dumb eight falls for the same drag. And goes for it. And what else am I see? Uh, Eric Kerr and, <coughs> and uh, David. Eric and David are basically this thing. We find out that that uh. Fumaga bucks the house. So Erica wants David to kiss her, give her a show. He does give a show. And you know, when Father hears that, she he she burns the cars down cars down like the waiting to excel and Oh, in the last scene, I forget there's one more scene that uh Benny goes to Mitch's, you know, uncle's trap house to get back the money. She finds that person, and one of the bitches finds them, and is about to kill him, and that was the end of the scene. If I miss anything in the end of the scene, let me know. If you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel. Like my videos, of course, comment on my videos, of course, share my videos. Anyway, this is your boy, D. I am out. Have a good night, y'all. Bye.